Thank you. An area near the Arkansas River with a reddish brown film caught the attention of a viewer concerned it may be harmful. So tonight, 11 listens taking the questions to the U of A Division of Agriculture. It's not every day you see red in the Arkansas River, but one viewer says she did and it prompted questions and concerns. It was also captured in these images at the Arkansas Game and Fish Nature Center in Pine Bluff. The reddish brown film that they're seeing is a plant that is widely distributed throughout the world. Um, in some places it is native, considered native. Urban stormwater agent John Pennington says it's called an azola plant or redwater fern. It's considered to be a noxious weed and an invasive plant in Arkansas. It grows so thickly that it's easy to notice. It also grows fast, but the current and cold weather can inhibit its growth, so it may not stick around very long. Still, it raises concern about safety and whether it's considered red tide. The plant they're seeing is not necessarily one, though, to be concerned about. It's not going to harm anybody. Uh, it's not really going to hurt uh, wildlife. Pennington says this is not considered red tide, which is typically found in the ocean because it has to live in salt water. While the red azola fern is considered to be a nuisance weed, there are things you can do to prevent a large algal bloom. Everybody should do their best to help keep uh, soil and fertilizer on their lawns and on their construction sites or on their farms uh, because soil carries uh, fertilizer nutrients with it. And these fertilizer nutrients are what can help um, the algae bloom. All right, so the plant also has the nickname Super Plant for its ability to remove pollutants like heavy metals from water and serves as a livestock feed. If you'd like to learn more about the plant, you can head to our website, THP11.com.